Good evening, America. I'm Javantius Jones, and here is the top story. Tonight, we're going to focus on the strict communist rulership in Russia. Currently, Joseph Stalin heads this totalitarian state, and many disagree with his tactics, one of which being utilizing his secret police to eliminate all competition, threats, and suspicious personnel. This time period of Stalin eliminating all dangerous opposition to declare himself total ruler is known as the Great Purge. Beginning in 1937, Stalin began a campaign to eliminate all threats, including past Bolsheviks who ran the Russian Revolution. Over the course of the purge, historians estimate Stalin was responsible for over 8 million deaths. With talking about such a fatal period, you must touch on the person or group responsible for it. We would start with his birthday, but he doesn't have one. Joseph Stalin was a huge fan of movies, specifically those featuring John Wayne. But that's not all. He preferred raspberry Georgian wine, and his musical preference was pianist Maria Udina. Had I not said we were talking about Stalin, you'd probably assume this news story was about a middle-aged woman. Without further ado, here is the man himself, Joseph Stalin. You, Stalin. Got him. Already then. Ah, it's a pleasure to have you. So first, if you don't mind me asking, you have found a lot of success westernizing. How is that? It's all about setting high standards. I always like to give my workers almost unattainable goals. Okay, and what about your shirt? Are you a fan of Superman? Actually, no, I don't care for him. The only reason I wear it is because my name actually means Man of Steel, and I don't like love scenes. Well, that's not the straightest thing we've heard. <laughs> and finally, what is your reason for killing millions of Russians? Well, Hey Jeff. Hey Jared, how's it going? Oh man, I'm not liking living in this country. Yeah, this country's awful. Stupid Stalin. The leader is just awful. He's not doing anything to help us out. He's just exporting everything. My family has been starving. Yeah, I've almost had to eat my own kid once. Yeah, I hate Stalin. Yeah, I hate him too. Such a deal. Son, how's it going? Hi Dad. Hey, I just... Son, I just gotta vent to you real quick. This, this uh, Stalin guy's just really making me mad. Why, Dad? Because he's totalitarian ruling. He's just trying to destroy the Kulak social class. It's just awful. I yeah. hate him. Yeah. I can go talk to your mother real quick. Hold okay. on. Okay. Hey, hey, Stalin. Yeah, my my dad's talking crap about you. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Jeff? Yo, dude, that's Stalin, man. Dude, I hate that man. Yeah, have you seen his mustache? Dude, that stuff looks so whack. Dude, it's like a turd under his nose. Dude, yo, that was good. Yo, they just heard us, man. Get out of here. I'm hungry. Waiter? Yes, sir. I want a turkey sandwich with mustard. Yes, sir. There's no mustard. Sorry, sir. We were all out. It's all right.
stone. Turns out there really is no mustard. How do you feel about killing him? Good. He's funny. LOL. Well, I'd say my reasons are justifiable. And I can't agree more. I'd say that's a close for tonight. I want to thank my brother, Joseph Stone. Blood Brothers? Hey, you shut your damn mouth! And, safe to say, Joseph Stalin, one of the in most interesting men in the world. And probably one of the most terrible. That's a close. Thanks again. Yep. I've got a parting gift for you.